Hello once again YouTube, this is Trevor Oslescu, owner of Monster Hobbies Online, your online hobby shop. Well today I'm actually filming in my dining room area, near my kitchen here, because I've got the basement kind of blocked up with a few things, so today we get to do this on the kitchen table. Anyway, I am going to show these models now. I won't be here for the next week. I've got some stuff I need to do. But then afterwards, I will put all these up on my website. I just wanted to give you a video for this week for you to watch something and, uh, you know, <laughs> keep uh, knowing that I'm active on my YouTube channel still. Anyway, so let's tear into this brand new box from Stevens International. So let's see what's in this box. I got my old scout knife here once again. And we can cut all this tape off of here. I swear these guys were in this pa packing gun around here about six times. <laughs> because it's always so thick. Okay. There's our invoice. Okay, so here we go. Here we go on another adventure. And what do we have in here? Well, I've got the American Superliner. Got a little bit mushed, I think, in the box. But overall, again, another really cool kit from AMT. So like I say, I won't be doing this this week, but next week I'll be putting these on. Now, I got a couple of models for myself again. Oh, that's interesting. I got something here I wasn't quite sure I was going to... Oh yeah, no, it's a restock. That's what it is. So I've got the International Scout Harvester 2. Now this one is going to be for me. Sorry. I can get another one though, don't worry about it. But I had one of these and I sold it to a friend of mine. And then afterwards I was like, gee, I wish I didn't sell that. So AMT, of course, brought this out again and I wanted to get one. And, you know, it was in between wanting to get this one, selling my friend the one I already had, and now needing to get this one to refill that hole. You know what I mean? <laughs> so anyway, there's that. Okay. So yeah, mostly restock. So I've got the 33 Willies here that again was a restock Coca-Cola one because it got sold by one of our good customers here. I've also brought in the 70 Ford Taxi. So again, there's another restock. Now this one is new, but it's discontinued. So this one I've actually got for a friend in Finland who wants to order it. This course is the 70 Corvette. Get them while you can. I can always bring in another one. Let me know in the comments below if you want one. There's the restock on the 59 Chrysler Imperial. Again, another great kit. Okay, then we've got our James Bond 70 Ford Galaxy police car. Look for that online. Then I also brought back in the Fire Chief. So again, another one that uh, is a restock. This is for me. This is a figure, 125th scale. That's uh, one of the At the Edge of the Galaxy series from Masterbox. I've got an idea for this one for a diorama. And then we've got the 1929 Ford Coca-Cola Woody. You can also build that as a pickup truck, of course. And then got another one here that hopefully will be sold off into Finland. You got a customer there that's into these sports cars, but this is the Toyota 2000 GT from 1969. There is one of these in a James Bond movie, and I believe it's a convertible, which I think was custom made for that one. And this is one for me. This is a really interesting one. This is a Toyota Mark II. They call this a Chaser. It's of course a 79 Toyota. Now look at this. Doesn't this look like almost like a Jaguar in the front? But then as you come here, it looks like a Mustang, like a 1970s Mustang, you know, maybe a Mustang II or something. So again, that's, I got it because it's just unique. And the taillights are really weird on here too. I mean, look at that. So I'm going to try to bring in some of these Aoshima Japanese cars in the future. But for now, I just want to unbox them because some of these are really weird. Like we don't see this in North America at all. So this is a Nissan Cedric, or Gloria, from 1978, the Brom. 
And again, I mean, look at that front end. Uh, that is so different from anything we usually see here. Look at the headlights are even like long rectangles, not little short ones or anything like back in the day. So again, a really unique, it's even a four door. Yeah, so that's also kind of odd. But anyway, that's what we have for now. So like I say, I will actually, because these are restocks, I can really just turn them back on on my website. So that's not too bad. Actually, there's only really one one thing that's kind of new to the list, isn't it? And then the rest of these are going off to uh, customers. <laughs> so anyway, so that about wraps it up. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you all next time. Happy model building, and have a great summer. Hey, everybody. I'm just going to do a little additional thing here. Um, when I opened this up, I was looking at it. I've actually got two car bodies in this kit. So check that out. I think I can build two of these cars. One sort of like a fastback short roof. Or are they the same? No, I don't know. But still, I mean, hey, I can build two kits out of this. So that's pretty cool. I wasn't expecting that at all. And then, uh, heh, check out chrome seats. <laughs> Bucket seat, bench seats in that, or chrome inside here. So again, that's really cool. Yeah, they give you two glass, two of everything in here. Yeah, cool. So if you're going to buy this kit or want me to bring it in, you actually get two cars. So there you go. It's the only one that actually has that. So anyway, that would explain the cost. <laughs> All right. Happy model building and enjoy.